Back on the news at 10, the record is simple. Six wins, three losses. UAB football is now bowl eligible. After a blowout win over Rice, the Blazers have three games left to improve their chances of playing in a bowl game, which has fans on campus really excited. That's where CBS 42 News reporter Stefan Dingle is right now. He's joining us live. And Stefan, Blazer football exceeding the expectations this year. Sherry, that and some. This magical season for the Blazers has students on campus fired up because nobody expected to blaze the Blazers to be where they are today. Bowl eligible and 5-0 and at home. Blazer Nation cheering full stride. Like they're shaking the foundation. Like There's nobody out here doing what UAB is doing right now. And I mean nobody. A program left for dead has revived the spirit of a city and a campus with a 6-3 and three record. Um, honestly, I'm glad they're back. I'm excited for them boys, you feel me? Because I was there the freshman year and everything before they got taken away. But I want to make sure they make it to this bowl game because last time they didn't even get to go. But not to worry. If the Blazers get selected this year, they will be there. It's just amazing to see how they rebuild the program. Like, just to remember us marching and, hey, we need our football team. To come here knowing that they didn't have a football program and it's returning this year and we're bowl eligible is just... It's <laughs> breath. Take it. It's just a very emotional topic for hardcore fans who know the story. But with the newfound hype behind these Blazers, students are fired up. It's been turned. Like, I mean, <laughs> just to say, like, we, I'm still in shock. Everybody's been pretty hyped so far. You know, football season is like something to really get excited about. So everyone's like really, really happy. This is just the beginning for us. It was a minor setback for a major comeback, and we're going to be bigger than ever. A minor setback for a major comeback. I think that's a great way to describe UAB's story. But get this, uh, the Blazers also have Shaq Jones, who is a semifinalist for the AFCA Good Works team, uh, which is one of the most prestigious off-the-field honors in college football in the nation. We're live in Birmingham. Stefan Diggle, CBS 42 News, local coverage you can count on.